Hey guys, so recently I watched Katy Perry's This Is How We Do, um, her music video, and I also watched this um, video when she was 17 that's going kind of viral right now, um, and she is hilarious, she is so cool, and she's so charismatic, and she's got such a great character in there, I had no idea, I haven't really looked into her much in the past, but now I'm like a massive fan, um, and so I figured I would do some nail art inspired by her um, video, and this is what I've done. There were so many different options to go with for this video, they were just, it's so full of colour and different scenes, and dots, and blah blah blah, and so I decided to go for the ice blocks, or popsicles or whatever you want to call them in your country um, and I think they're really cute so I hope you guys like them um, if you do recreate them tag me on Instagram at nailed.nz all the links will be down below please subscribe and thumbs up this video and I'll see you later start off by applying a base coat this will protect your nails from staining and make the polish last longer now paint your index finger coral your middle finger blue your ring finger a Tiffany blue or green and your pinky orange. Make sure all these shades are quite light. The thumb just needs to be painted white. Do at least two coats of each colour to make sure the background is nice and opaque. As there are five different designs in this tutorial, I'll do one at a time starting with this ice cream guy. Paint a brown elongated triangle onto your nail and fill it in. With a navy blue, paint on some bendy legs. Make some swirly ice cream at the top of them with a light pink. Then create some eyes with white and black polish. Add a couple of white strokes to his knees for disjointed hands. And now we are on to the pizza, which I have done on my middle nail. Like last time, start off with the triangle, but make it a lot bigger and make it yellow. Fill it in with colour. With a light brown, make a curve at the bottom of the pizza which will be the crust. Now paint on two white ovals for the whites of the eyes. Add some big red dots around the pizza for the salami. And some small brown dots for other toppings. Now paint on the black pupils. I did mine with a tiny triangle cut out in them to copy the picture exactly and represent the light. However, it's really a minor detail so you can just fill it in if you like. Make a few little white dots in some of the toppings. And add some orange dots to the pepperoni to give it some more detail. Paint on some disjointed black shoes and white socks. Next with the white polish, paint on some hands. This one's giving the thumbs up and the other one's holding a cup. And that's the pizza done. Next we have this kind of ice cream sandwich guy who is looking very grumpy. Start off by painting some dark brown polish onto your nail in this shape. Add some little brown shoes. Next, carefully paint a light pink line from one edge of the nail right down to the middle at the bottom. Then add green legs. 
paint on some white eyes. And make a few dots just above them. Make a small dot for a mouth in green. Add some pink to the eyes and then add some black pupils. And that's him done. Now on to the pinky, the stuck themed ice block. Start off with the same sort of shape we did for the last one, but this time in red. Use brown polish to make the shape of the stick at the bottom of the red. Then use a light green to make a curve that joins on to the top of the red. Add on a smaller yellow dot, which will be the beak. And make some small light blue dots on the red part. Use a larger white and a smaller black dot to make the eye. And that's the duck nail done. The last nail on the thumb is one of my favourites and it's based off one of the scenes from the video where it's got the word do. Make a couple of half squares on your nails. I have used a pastel Tiffany green and also a light pink. Using a black striking brush, make a line going from one side of your nail to the other. Roll your nail as you're doing this to help keep it straight. Do the same thing across the rest of your nail and then do it again in the other direction. Next paint on a D and an O in white polish. First just do it fairly thin so you can get the shape right, but after that you can go through and thicken it up. Next go over the white with the yellow polish. Outline the lettering in black and then give it a shadow. Now do a quick clean up with a brush dipped in nail polish from River and apply a top coat. And that's it! I hope you liked this tutorial and if you did please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thanks heaps for watching and I'll see you later.